New information in the fatal police shooting of Jay Anderson in Wauwatosa. The attorney for Anderson's family says he was shot six times and had his hands up just prior to the shooting. 12 News Nick Bohr is live in Madison Park and Nick, the information is in a notice of claim to the city. And right, Kathy, that notice of injury is likely the first step in what will be a civil lawsuit against Wauwatosa at some point. But Attorney John Safran says Jay Anderson wasn't bothering anybody last June here in Madison Park, sitting in his car when a police officer came up to him. After hours, the officer approached the car, saw a gun on the seat, and a short time later shot Anderson to death. Now, that notice of injury was filed yesterday against Wauwatosa. It includes the officer's name, Joseph. Mensa. It says Mensa was back patrolling the streets after being involved in another fatal shooting just 11 months earlier. The filing indicates Mensa may have filed for disability after that shooting, but it was denied. Now, neither we nor Anderson's attorney have been able to confirm that. The Tosa City attorney has refused to comment. The family's been shown enhanced squad video, they say, shows Anderson lowering his arms just before he's shot. The family attorney doesn't believe, though, it shows Anderson lunging for a gun. I don't see that. I, I don't see anything that would make me believe that he lunged for anything. And again, unfortunately, with the department officers having removed that handgun, which they allege was in the front uh, seat of the vehicle, we now don't know where it was in the vehicle. And this, that is a problem. Now, Anderson's family wants that video released as soon as possible. Once again today, the district attorney's office, though, telling us it won't be released until their investigation is complete, and there's no timetable on that. Reporting live in Madison Park here in Wauwatosa, Nick Bohr, WISN 12 News.